Hey guys, what's up? Just thought I'd real quickly um, show you uh, the DVDs that I have, the DVDs that I have in here. This is one of my um, uh, storage bins that I also use a, as a foot rest or a leg rest as you can see. So I thought I'd take a chance to kind of show you what I have in here. And if I have time I'll show you what's in the closet but it's not too much. But mostly what's here uh, movie wise and everything. And the reason I have a lot of stuff in here is it makes it easier so I could, you know, probably play it on there down the line. You know, on the, on the TV, on on either my, uh, let's see, just get zoomed in there a little bit. Sorry for the blur. Uh, on my uh, DVD player, which is right there that you can see. My uh, DVD player right there, like which you can see. Oh, even my uh, Blu-ray player, which is right there. So, either either way, have the option to to be able to talk about that, so to be able to watch them. Um, so anyway, what what do I have in here, movie-wise? So let's let's take a look real quickly, or DVD-wise. Of course, I have the VHS of Transformers the movie in here, along with Mighty Ducks the first face-off. I have basically the Flash seasons one and two. It goes for a second. And then here you can pretty much see what I do have, um, kind of. This is a kind of a, a unique kind of thing. It's by Joanne Priestie. It's got films based on her. It's a uh, Finding Gravity. I also have another one on her too, somewhere. I think it's under here somewhere, maybe. maybe. No, that's uh, Garfield Fun Fest. Uh, but yeah, I have this. It's pretty cool. And then, like I said, you can see here what I have. Um, right there, you can see I have GoBots Battle of the Wat Rock Lords, 13 Goes, the Ninja Turtles documentary. Uh, that they did, which is uh, this one. And I have uh, Plunder and Lightning. I think this is the uncut version. It has the uncut version. It's the kind of copy that I sent to Zara Nizarak, so I have that. I have uh, Back to the Future, the complete animated series. I have Superman, the animated series, complete. I have, this is, um, Volume 2 of Batman, the animated series. I have Yogi's Gang, Hey There, Jogi Bear, Batman, the Return of the Joker, complete series, the complete series of Sonic X, Angry Video Game Nerd, the movie, uh, the Looney Tunes Show, Volume 1, the complete series of Heathcliff and the Cadillac Cats, uh, what else do we have here? Uh, Blood Rain. I think this is a Blood Rain. There's Blood Rain. This is the one that Nostalgia Critic reviewed with Linkara and Spoonie. Then I have, uh, Saved by the Bell. Oh, that's, no, brought up Blood Rain again, so that's the one. But I um, have Saved by the Bell right here, which is uh, the unauthorized Saved by the Bell story, basically a biography, basically A and E, you know, a lifetime put it together, I think. I think that's where it is. Yeah, lifetime put this together back in uh, 2014. It's been about five years almost. Well, it's been about five years, depending on when it was released. Then I have Godzilla, the the animated series based on the 1998 movie, and of course, like I said, Garfield Fun Fest. Then I have Batman Beyond, the animated series, complete. Looney Tunes, uh, Superstars, with um, Daffy Duck, Sylvester, and Porky.
have um, Sonic Underground, Dr. Robotnik's Revenge, and I got the Sonic Mega Mix, Yu-Gi-Oh! The Movie, Pebbles and Bam Bam Show, Smurf Season 1, Pac-Man 1 and 2, or Seasons 1 and 2, Sonic Underground Volume 2, uh, Legend of Zelda Complete Series, Super Mario World The Complete Series, Sonic the Hedgehog Saturday AM Complete Series, Steel Sealed. Uh, I do have another one that I did crack open, but this is Steel Sealed. Been sealed for about 12 years, can you believe that? Then I have X-Men The Anime, the anime that they did, the X-Men anime. Sonic Underground Volume uh, 2, uh, Volume 1. The uh, Doomsday Project movie I put together myself. Complete series of Sonic Adventures of Sonic the Hedgehog. Then another Sonic Underground, which is uh, Secrets of the Chaos Emerald. And then this one, the infamous Lion Gates release that came out around 2004. So that's pretty cool. And then it got Dragon's Lair, the complete series. Uh, Top Cat and the Beverly Hills Cat. Challenge, Challenge of the Gobots. Snorks, the complete first season. Yogi Bear, Yogi and Division of the Space Bears, Laugh Olympics, uh, Spooky Games is the most of Laugh Olympics, and a couple of volumes of it, Volume 1 and 2 of Laugh Olympics, right here. Then I have Snorks, Second Season, Animaniacs one, Volume 1, Tiny Toons Volume 1, Animaniacs Volume 4, Pinky and the Brain, um, Volume 2, Tiny Toons Volume uh, uh, season 1, Volume 2. Then I have Volume 3 of Tiny Toons and Volume 4. The other Animaniac is, is over there on that thing. So, over there. They got another Looney Tunes Superstar deal. This one has Bugs Bunny, Foghorn, and Wiley and Wart Roadrunner. Then I have Batman, Volume 1, I think. In Volume 1, Batman the Animated Series. Then I have Pepe Le Pew. And then I got a couple of my SNES games in here along with some of my NES games. And I got um, Hero of the Year, DC Superhero Girls movie. Then a couple of volumes of Voltron when they were in the tin, of course. I have the Red Lion and I have, I have the Green Lion. And of course I have, if I can pull that out here for a second, I have the Red Lion uh, as well. Now, there are some movies underneath here, so we're going to move these for a second. Just for a sec, so you can get a better idea of what we have. Not much, but just a better idea. It's going to take me a bit to put them back in, but it's okay. Um, here you can see I have some of uh, my NES games down here, along with some uh, DVDs as well. We have this that has a lot of that on there, you can see for yourself. Kim Possible, so the drama. A lot of these DVDs I actually recorded when I lived in Kansas, so. And when I came out to visit one time, there were movies we did see, and they're like, oh, you need to see this. Kind of stuff, so, I took a chance. You know, can't do anything unless you take a chance, right?
on for a sec. Sorry for the abrupt, abrupt thing. I'm probably going to have to edit this together now. That's okay. So we're going to look under here. And this will give you a better idea of what I'm talking about. Out of what I have. So here, I'm going to move these just a bit. I have the complete season, or the complete series of Yu-Gi-Oh! Yes, the complete series of Yu-Gi-Oh! You can pretty much see that there. Complete series of Yu-Gi-Oh! right here. I have the Looney Tunes movie, Rabbits Run, Rabbits Run. I have Scooby-Doo movie, Mission to Mars. I have the Naruto movie. English. Pull it out for a second. Now this the Nero, this Neurotro movie. This is uh, the last, the last. Uh, well, it's just called the last. Is what it is. I, I want to get it on Blu-ray, but I don't know. Uh, my job doesn't sell the Blu-ray anymore. I might have to go online for that. Um. Anyway, I have Tiny Tunes, How I Spent My Summer Vacation, Complete Series of the Lionhearts, Get Along Gang Cartoons, The Complete Series of Kid Video, SWAT Cats, The Radical Squadron, Garfield Pet Force, and Relative Orbits, another Joanne Priestley thing. So now, hold on for a sec, folks. I'm not going to take another mistake here, so... We'll set you right there while we work on this for a second. Okay, now I'm going to pull these things out. I had to put them back as well eventually. But, as you can see down here, I have Cats Don't Dance. You can hopefully see that right there. It's Cats Don't Dance. I have Inhumanoids, complete series. Super Friends, volume 2. The complete, and this is no joke, you can see it all the way across. All of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the complete series. I have the complete series of Jason the World Warriors, two volumes. A couple of volumes of Heathcliff and the Cadillac Cats. I think one of them is the movie. Oh, let me let me look for a second, guys. Oh yeah, it's the complete season again. It's the complete series of Heathcliff. It's basically the complete series that you get here, but it was released like that individually in, in two volumes. And then I've got uh, Mickey Mouse, the Mickey Mouse cartoon season one. And then, Rob the Wonderful recently did a review on this. Street Sharks, complete series. Got the good, the bad, the Huckleberry Hound. And then there's all the games. I'm going to push those up for a second, if they let me. We have down here, Ninja Turtles, The Next Mutations, Volume 1 and 2, basically a complete series. The Ninja Turtles um, DVD that came out that started the whole trend. Another copy of Ninja Turtles as well, that I have over here somewhere. Basically it's a complete series. 
Darkwing Duck, copies of those. And then, of course, some wrestling, uh, straight out of Dudleyville. Um, Eric Bischoff. Heart of Gold, which is Owen Hart. This one, um... Oh, didn't know. Chibets. How about that? I have Nagika Blitz Tactics. Right here. Then Disney Movie DVD. Let's see what we have on this baby. Let's see what we have there on that. And then here, Garfield Fun Fest. And then over here, we have World's Finest. Yes, I've been looking for that. And then, of course, believe it or not, I have a couple of DVDs from Netflix. I've had rented out for the past couple of years that I now have to return. And I'm probably going to do that. But anyway, I thought I'd just give you guys a look at some of the DVDs I have in my storage unit here. Um, hope you guys enjoyed it. Again, sorry for the abrupt interruption. Uh, let me know what you guys think down below. And thank you all for watching. God bless. And take care. And that's going to do it. It's very, okay, guys. I don't know if you can see this very well because of the lighting. But I'm going to just go through it quickly. These are, the one, these are some of the movies I have right here up front. So what I have here is, of course, Holly Rocket by Baby. And then, of course, there's a variety disc with the movie Basic, the Sonic OVA, and uh, Cowboy Bebop the movie, before I got it on Blu-ray. And here, um, this is the copy of Sat AM that I do watch watch from right here. I have the complete season of the Best Thing Bears, the PBS one, all the G.I. Joe, um, Beast Machines, Transformers, Transformers D1, Transformers Beast Wars, which is underrated and people should watch it especially the fact that it's a continuation of Transformers and then over here I have all the anime versions of Transformers as well the Headmasters, Master Force and Victory and then behind there that's kind of what I have there um, as well just pull that out for a second Kind of see what I have behind there. I can see, kind of see what I have there. So a um, little bit of light can get in there. And then uh, down here, I have some of the uh, other pony stuff. Uh, some She-Ra ponies of G1, that is. What's this? Oh, let's figure that out. I mean, that belongs to one of my Transformers, I think. So, let's put that up here somewhere. Um, anyway, I got She-Ra. I got My Little Pony Tales. My Little Pony G1, the complete series. And... Um, I have to move some of my stuff here, but uh, I don't want to move anything. Hold on for a sec. Oh, <sighs> get the flashlight out here for a second. One thing about having a small room, it's kind of hard. But like I said, you know, you better see what I have as well. Um, but right here, like I said, I got uh, all this. Right here, these are the movies I have. I've got Thundercats, both right there. You can kind of see that now a little bit better. Thundercats Complete Series. And then, down there, there's a few more things that I do have. Let me see if I can move the boxes just a bit. You can see. 
and you can see right there what I do have uh, as well so yeah I've got a pretty good collection of stuff so Groovy Ghoulies back there too, so it's cool. Okay, so I can just uh, hold this up for a second. See what else I have. Let me move. Yeah, I got Lion Force. Lion Force is basically the anime, the uncut anime, if you will. And then, like I said, Groovy Ghoulies. And Go Lion. So I got. Most of go line here. Yeah, line for well, line force is basically Voltron, but uh, uh, Groovy, Groovy Ghoulies is um, uh, essentially uh, Groovy Ghoulies is essentially. I mean, not Groovy Ghoulies, but Go Line is essentially the anime of of the um, of Voltron. It's basically the series that Voltron came from. So. Yeah, go figure that. So anyway, just thought I'd take the time to kind of show you guys a little bit of what I have, DVD-wise and you know complete series-wise. So that's about it, guys. So I'm gonna clean up this a little bit, and I will talk to you all later.